scared at all. He's not scared? No. Why does he always shake? While I was reviewing some footage, I found this. This is from a couple of days after David Bourne was attacked by Rockwall police while filming a traffic stop. I wasn't going to upload this because the truth of what's going on here is going to trigger a lot of people, but it's important. To show the context of what's going on, we go back a couple of days to this scene where myself and David are recording this traffic stop, one of us on one side, one of us on the other side. The cop you see here is Officer Bruce. Stay on that side, don't get behind me. Officer Bruce was under the impression that he got to tell people where they could and couldn't stand in public areas while recording him. No, that's not the law. Shut up and do your job. He thought that he had the right to tell me and David that we have to stand side by side while recording him for his safety. When we refused, he called for backup. I need you both on the same side, okay? Is that a lawful order? Yes, because I have to be able to watch you both. That's not a law. No. I can control where you are if you're going to be this close to my partner. And your name is? Hartman. I appreciate it. Thank you. Officer Hartman then off. goes to bark the same stupid orders at David. See, As David continually back backs back away, back back Hartman back continually back approaches him until Hartman attacks. After Hartman attacks, rather than stopping Hartman, all the other officers on scene join in the attack. Get back! Get off! Get your hand off your gun! You going to let him arrest him? Yes. What's, uh, what's the charge? I, I don't know. I wasn't well, here, so okay. I, I'm Can not we going ask to. him what the charge is? He'll, I'll get that from here. In a bit. So we're arresting him. We don't even know what the charge is yet. He does. I <laughs> not. I just showed up. You're the supervisor. You're not going to make sure there's no unlawful arrest by no. saying, "Hey, what's the charge?" I, I believe in my guys, and I trust them. Are you still scared? Are you? Are you still scared? Quit acting like a bitch. All right. You're a grown ass man. You are a grown man. Start acting like it. All right. Your mother ought to slap the shit out of you. How are you doing tonight? Doing good. Good? So a few days after the Blue Line gang attacked a friend of mine for documenting their gang activities, I saw a handful of the same gang members in a QT parking lot. I grabbed my cameras as quick as I could to go talk to them, but they could see me coming and ran. Only one officer was left by the time I got my camera out and got out of the truck. So that's where we're at now, and we're about to come to the uncomfortable truth. Whether you're a right snowflake or a left snowflake, this is a trigger warning. He's not scared at all. He's not scared? No. While I ask the gang member if Officer Bruce is still scared, I see a bootlicker out of the corner of my eyes shaking his head at me. You got a bootlicker right over here? What's that? Um, filming the whole area. What's that? What's our, it's, well then don't come up to the camera. Okay, what are you filming for? What's that? What are you filming I document for? all kinds of stuff. For what? Um, just for the purposes of documenting. Yeah, but if you don't want to be documented, I'd stay away from the camera. As you can see, there are people out there who are dumber than police. No, it's, it's cameras document. If you walk up to a camera, it will record you. Do you no, understand how that works? In my direction, so that's why I was asking. Oh, okay. And I have every right to ask. <laughs> why are you, you know, having me on film and everything? Well, this this doesn't actually have a good zoom on this device right here. It's just a cell phone. But when you get close to it, then you're like perfectly in frame. Then does that make sense? I like how it says freedom on your shirt. What? I like how I like your shirt, man. I like it. Couldn't miss an opportunity to tell somebody he's a veteran. I like your shirt. What? What's the issue? It's my job. I'm a, I'm a veteran. But, 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 but. The U.S. has been at war for my entire adult life, over 20 years. Allegedly, veterans have been fighting for freedom this entire time. During that 20 years, the people in the U.S. have consistently become less free. Apparently, about two decades ago, somebody stole all of our freedoms and ran to Afghanistan with them. Then, while our troops went to Afghanistan to recover our freedoms, they jumped to Iraq. Our freedoms have consistently bounced around the globe, and nobody has been able to capture them yet. Hopefully, someday our troops will be able to find our freedoms and bring them back so that we can exercise them without being attacked by terrorists. Guys, get hey, off him! Stay with him! Don't touch him! Well then, gosh, buddy, thanks for my freedom.